this is probably going to be your easiest tutorial that I'm going to give you in this whole series. We're going to learn how to put comments in your code. Now, first things first, what are comments? They're literally uh, just words in your code um, that are ignored by the compiler. And what the compiler is, is the thing that processes all your code and turns it into a program. So, let me let me give you an example. All right. So we've we've written hello world. Okay. We've printed hello world to the console. Um, now let's make that a comment. So this is now a comment. All right. If we play that, nothing's going to happen because this line of code was ignored because it's a comment. And if we go back, and there we go, we got it back. So I can literally above this, I can say, okay, this is a uh, statement to print to the world. Alright, and it'll ignore that completely. Alright, so no matter what it says, if there's two forward slashes uh, before your statement, uh, before whatever, then it will be a comment. Alright, comments don't carry on to the next line, as you can see. Yeah. So, if you want, you know, multiple lines of comments, then you can either do that, yeah, it's <laughs> Eclipse does have spell check. Um, so, but also another way. Let's do that. And if you're not sure what I did there, what I did was I forward slash two asterisks and then I press enter and Eclipse did the rest. Okay. Um, so for each new line, it will add an asterisk, and to end off, you know, the chunk of comments. Uh, it will have another asterisk and a backslash. Or is that another forward slash? That's another forward slash. Alright, my, my, my pad. And so we can literally just type... Uh, and all that will be ignored. As we can see. So, that's literally it. That, that's the end of this tutorial. Uh, <laughs> Feel fr make sure to leave a like and a comment and definitely go and subscribe to follow along with this series. Also, if there's anything you don't understand so far, you know, such as uh, the main method or even this little statement right here, do not worry. I felt like this, you know, when I first started up programming, it will get easier, okay? Unless you're really stupid. If you're really stupid, then I'm sorry. Okay, you might not be able to do any of this. But if you're relatively not stupid, then... You don't have to be smart, you just have to be not stupid. And you can carry on, carry along and you will be able to do this. Trust me. Alright? Speaking from my own experience and experience of other people. So, just trust me. Alright, have a fantastically brilliant day, guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.